If you guys are looking for super cheap, fast, and reliable Madden 22 Ultimate Team coins, look no further than my sponsor, MuttReserve.com. They're super awesome to work with, and they have 24-7 support. Head over to MuttReserve.com and use code Poodle at checkout for 15% off your order. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today, I'm going to be going over how to play Madden 22 early on EA Access on PS5, Xbox One, Xbox Series X, PS4, and as well as the computer. So I'm going to show you guys all this as well, but before we get into the video, make sure you go down below, hit that subscribe button, turn on that notification bell, give this video a big thumbs up as always. If you haven't already, guys, we want to be shouted out the Poodle Squad. All you got to do is like the video and comment down below Poodle Squad. Once you do all those things, you are shouted out. For today's shout out, we have Michael Cavanaugh. Shout out to you, man, for being a part of the Poodle Squad. Thank you for showing support. Appreciate each and every one of you guys. Now, if you guys don't already know, EAX has been a little messed up, like, in terms of the drop. It's live. It's not live, right? We've It's been a rough morning in terms of that. But I'm going to show you guys exactly how to do this because I know this is going to be a popping question the moment we're able to use it. And I probably won't be using a video up during the day once the game's actually out to go ahead and show you this. So I'm going to show you this now. You can use this when the game does drop. It's going to be beneficial from now until until you guys are done with the trial, right? So, I'm going to show you this today. Now, again, like I said, it could drop later today. It could drop tomorrow. Par sources are confirming probably tomorrow at this point. But still, come check it out and get ready for this, guys. Now, on guys is EA Access is where it's going to be dropped. So a lot of people get confused with this. They're like, do I have to buy the game? Do I have to do that? Typically, no. Typically, with the trial, you can just go ahead. And as long as you have EA Play, which also comes with Game Pass and Xbox and a few other ways to get that, um, you should be good to go on the trial. You do not have to go buy the game. Now, if you do buy the game, that's how you'll get full access to it on the 17th. So I still recommend that if you plan to play. But if you just want to try it out, that's always the way to go to or just play early, which is always one of the main reasons that people actually do go ahead and get the trial. So let's head on over. So my games and apps are going to be one of you, where you want to go on Xbox. Right, so we'll start with Xbox. Then we'll head to PS5. Then we'll head to this uh, computer. On Xbox, a lot of people are going to be sitting here. They're going to see this. They're going to keep clicking this and wondering why this doesn't work. This is access to the full game. This will not work until the game is officially out unless the trial gets dropped and they mix them together and it's not a, it's, it could be a separate icon for the trial but it also could be mixed once it's mixed that will work but you have to get the trial activated before that link itself will work so you're going to want to do is go to my games and apps go down to groups and then right below groups going to be full library so remember right here full library if you have ea play you'll see the ea play games so there's gonna be a few ways to check for this ea play you could first a scroll down and check through games. I like to do this too as well because you just never know. They, it was really weird last year trying to find it. Last year was in the store under a drop down arrow for it to work. So EA Madden 1920 and 21. So if it's going to show up, it'll be right after 21, probably right here. Make sure you check this place. As well as scrolling back up, you'll see the game trials. Click on game trials and there should be a trial here as well. But like I said last year, the trials wasn't, the trial didn't show, the axe didn't show. It ended up being in the store under play now trial or something. So don't assume that the most obvious where it should be is where it will be. So EA Gameplay Trials will be right there. Then if you don't see it in games or game trials and it's out, go to EA Play. Now, if you go under EA Play, now guys, this will apply for all systems. So just remember, use the um, for the other systems, I'll show you the layout. But use the setup for that for the most part. So if you scroll down here, you'll see Picks for You. Picks for You, it could pop up there. It could pop up anywhere on here, right? Because this is technically what it's showing you. Now, again, if you go into the store this year, it will not work for Madden like it used to because if you go to the store on next gen, there's no drop down arrow like it used to. There could be a way around that later, but currently there's no current setup to go to the store and try to finesse the trial like we did last year. So back into that, that's the ways there. Now, again, you could always go to all own games. You could scroll all the way down to here and check as well, which would be right below where here you see the current gen, next gen, and then we have the beta. So it would probably be somewhere right in this area. But again, I think the best bet's going to be full library, EA Play. Now, you could always check Game Pass as well. Um, but again, I don't recommend that. I think it'll be under one of these tabs here. You can go to uh, ready to install. You can go to sort by console type. You can sort group by letter. But I think the best bet's going to be right here, right here, and somewhere down here. Now, that's going to be for the Xbox when it does go live. Again, it was supposed to be live today. Early confirmation from a lot of people who have insider sources are saying it's not going to probably go live anymore today. Probably go live tomorrow, which means the game probably has something that they still have to drop or the server wasn't ready or they just suck. I don't really know, but that's part of the reason here. So this is for Xbox. That's how you're going to be able to go ahead and finesse and get your trial on Xbox. Now, important trials are 10 hours. Just going to get some questions out of the way. Trials are 10 hours. Yes, there probably will be a glitch to have unlimited time. Yes, there'll probably be a way to have five accounts and use them all. Um, there are ways around that. If you don't play Ultimate Team, though, you can just make five accounts. They don't have to transfer over. You could just hop on a new account every time and keep playing. If you have multiple Xboxes, you can just do that. You can game share. A lot of different ways. And yes, your consoles, uh, this accounts on your console, if you own Game Pass yourself or the EA Play, they will all get it, I'm pretty sure. So you can go ahead and have five different accounts. It's 50 hours. If you're not a Mutt player, you could probably use that for regs online. You'll have plenty of time. If you're a Mutt player, you know that's that 50 hours is just, just enough probably, right? Um, if you want to grind. 
But that's it for that. Let's head on over to you guys the PS5 and the online. Yeah, so here is going to be the PS5 screen. Now, I have a PS5. It's in the other room. Instead of loading that up and buying EA Play and everything on it, I have a screenshot from Twitter of how you're going to go ahead and do this. Now, if you head on over to where EA Play is on your PS5, you're going to see EA Play list. These are the games that currently could be played at this exact moment. FIFA 21, Mud 21. You have the racing game. You have the other racing game, the Dirt Rally 2.0. I believe you have another Madden at some point down there as well. You probably have Madden 20. Um some ufc probably there's gonna be a few games right now below that will show the ea play early access trials now for some reason on xbox it doesn't show the early access trials but on ps4 it's been there apparently for at least two hours now so that's gonna say unavailable so for ps5 it's looking ps5 and ps4 are probably similar it's looking pretty easy you're just gonna go ahead to this list and it should be there now if you click it it's gonna say unavailable i imagine when it's ready it'll say available now quick tip guys you're gonna ask if it says unavailable and people are getting in what do you do best recommendation for xbox hold down the power button for 10 seconds force restart it unplug the ethernet unplug everything plug it back in that usually resets it similar to updates if you guys have ever gotten it like if you ever tried to play madden and it won't let you get into a game and you find out there's an update and when you back out you can't find the update but if you restart the xbox it like resets the server and the network and you get the update similar to that you're kind of pushing it through so if however you do it on the xbox and how you do it on the ps5 you know ps5 is probably a little bit different maybe it's hold the button maybe it's with the middle button on the remote make sure you go ahead and force reset and do 10 seconds do the whole the whole the whole nine to make sure that you are resetting because there's been times last year where like people are getting in and i've been there earlier than them and i can't get it but that's because i'm not resetting once i reset everything shows up so make sure you are doing that guys um now let's get on over to the uh the the other side which is going to be the internet which is origins all right guys so the screen's gonna look a little bit weird just because it's on the origins app and the whole thing's a little bit too big right now and i have it all set up for madden already but if you guys do look here there's gonna be the origins app now you can go online and do this or you can go on ea play so what you want to do is if you don't have ea play go to eaplay.com join now start the account and then you're going to download origins desktop you don't have to but i'd prefer i'd prefer you do download the origins desktop app through the ea play i'll, I'll give you the whole link for everything uh when you do it so it's going to say search games are more in the corner which you see my cursor will be right here to the left so you're going to type in you can either type in madden 22 and this is what it will bring so this is the problem so you can check here you can go to madden 22 and try to click here where it says pre-order and check if it says like trial under it right but it currently doesn't it could, but it may, it may never do that, right? So the next option is going to be go to Browse Games or go to, actually go to EA Playlist. Go to your EA Playlist right here, and then I would filter by uh, all the way down to Franchise, where a Franchise, and go to Madden. Once you go to Madden, it's going to show you all the Madden games that are available under this. Now, the first time I did this, it only showed Madden. Now, of course, it's going to show every game in existence. Uh, Madden, it only showed four the first time. So Madden, here we go. So you're going to Madden, you're going to see there's going to be three games, Madden 21, Madden 20, Madden 19. Now, all you're going to do is keep refreshing. Now, the problem with the the Origins app is you can't keep refreshing. So what I would recommend, you go on the web, you go on Origins.com there, and you refresh that one. Once you see it go live on there, head to the app possibly and try to download it from there or try to download it from the web. Either way, guys, that's going to be the best way to do it on Origin. Now, if you guys have any other way like Steam and stuff, there's other ways, but I recommend Origins. It's pretty simple. And why would you want to go PC? There's a few reasons. First off, PC usually drops earlier than console does. So if you want to get a head start or you want to record your content creator, that's kind of the way to go sometimes. Also, if you are a PC player, right? That could be a thing. You're just a PC game you want to play. But again, there's the Xbox, the PlayStation 5. The current gen should be very, very similar. Uh, current gen has an E-access hub, at least they used to. So you might have to use the hub. Still very, very similar. Not much of a difference. And then there's going to be the Origins. But that's about it, guys. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. And always like the video as well for this tip. I hope this helped you guys out. Hopefully, tomorrow, guys, we're coming back at you guys with all Madden 22 content. I'm tired. I'm sick and tired of waiting at this point. Uh, you know, especially when I was ready for it today and it's not today. Definitely sucks. But hopefully, you guys enjoyed. If you guys want to be shout out in the Poodle Squad, all you got to do is like the video. Comment down below Poodle Squad and turn on that noti bell. And anyways, let me know if this does help you guys out. Be ready, guys. I mean, be, I would follow me on Twitter. I will announce more than likely when it goes live. So... When I know, you'll know. So follow me on Twitter as well, and then you guys can go ahead and start refreshing and doing all the, again, the nine you got to do. So yeah, enjoy the rest of your day. I'm out. Peace.